I haven't felt this bad since I drove by that speed sign. Your speed is 32. <laughs> Look, they're going to say him, your speed is fat. <laughs> They ain't gonna say some JK LOL in the mind arc is meant to suicide. Me getting my 351st haircut. And here's when I couldn't take no more. I killed that barber. This is my Jew flattening machine. It'll flatten any Jew. Oh, they, they, they going to hand with the little dark humor jokes. Like, bro, talking about some it'll flatten any Jew. Like, bro, what? Wow, hey, I ain't gonna lie though. I feel like this the only show that can literally get away with like little stuff like this though. But I mean, eh, eh. Simply climb behind the wheel, drive it towards a Jew, and flatten him. Could he also use it just to drive from place to place and stuff? It, it's a Jew flattening machine. It, it's not what it's designed for. But you could use it that way. Yeah, yeah, you could. Yeah, yeah, you could, you could also use the Mona Lisa as a placemat. God. <laughs> It's a boy, Mrs. Quagmire. Ah, that's wonderful. How do you feel? Horny. Really horny. Could you put him back in and out a few times? I was born nine... He was born nine times. ...times that day. Coward! I have found you! Ah! I remember this. He oh shot me and shit. Are you okay? Quick, somebody call an ambulance. This could need stitches. And if we don't want Damn, so they just said, forget Meg, she dead. We gon' we gon' ask Stewie. He the one he hurt. We're gonna call an ambulance. Fuck Meg. Meg dead. Want this to leave a scar. No, there's no time for an ambulance. We gotta take him to the hospital right away. Guys, I'm alright. I, I think Meg Oh my god, he's delirious. He's talking nonsense. Quick, everybody in the car. <laughs> then how would she fall backwards though? You're right, like, that's what girl. I don't get. Run like a man, you get a shoot. Hey, what's your big idea? Then if I really get him in the cast with a uh, shouldn't be in the studio. Can I have that record? I love that song. I'll let you have some. About 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 the burbs of word. Let's see what your daughter looks like. She's uh, right there. Okay. Hey, bro, don't fall be playing with me. Top like bro. Like, why y'all be doing my uh, my girl me like that, bro? Like, bro. Bruh, like why y'all why y'all doing her like that, bruh? She she might be ugly, but you know what I'm saying? You made her though. So she look beautiful to you. Okay, I'll do her. But can you tell her to cry and beg me to stop? I think that can be arranged. Okay, Mrs. Swanson, you're almost there. Push! Push! Get out of there! Get the hell out of my wife, you little bastard! When the fuck did she have a baby though? Okay, here we go. Hold on, the wheelchair is coming first. And here's the baby. How does a wheelchair fit? How does a wheelchair grow inside a human? Baby. Congratulations, Mrs. Swanson. It's a beautiful baby girl. Oh, Bonnie, I'm so happy for you. Oh, my God, she's dying. What? Oh, sorry, I was watching this Paula Poundstone comedy special. <laughs> To my last night as a free man. Hmm. Unfortunate timing. Now, which one of these scumbag firemen will go after his fiance? Already happened. We're very happy. New Brian is just a new friend for the family. Trust me, you guys are gonna get along. And that's how this should be for real, for real, sadly though. Hey, Dale. I noticed your lawn's getting a little high. Yeah, I used to have a guy for that, Dick. Okay, now you have a good one. Okay, Peter, I'm off to my book club. Hey, um... doing... Oh, I just realized what. Oh, it took me a little second. Hold on, could look, could bruh. Hey, Dale, I noticed your lawn's getting a little high. Yeah, I used to have a guy for that, Dick. <laughs> There's Abraham Lincoln. He's saying he used to have a guy for this, so basically he had him a him a slave. 
Okay, now you have a good one. It, I had to catch it. If Abraham went in this gen, I think I would have never caught it though. Like, nah, I guess it had to have Abraham in it for somebody to get that shit. Good. And you better be responsible tonight. I don't want to repeat it the last time I left you alone with one of our children. <sighs> it's just so horrible. I'm sorry, Lois. I thought if I shook him enough, he'd stop crying. I was kind of right. And this is the kitchen. We've got all kinds of snacks and cold drinks in here. Well, I don't see the refrigerator. Oh, we just use Ann Coulter. Hmm. There's never anything good what in here. What the hell? Now return to Superman. <laughs> Lois, what's wrong? Clark, we all have breast cancer. The doctor says it's <clears throat> as if our breasts have been x-rayed five hours a day every day for the last three years. Oh, my God, that's terrible. First every woman I've ever known. And oh, so they're Superman. Look, Tom, Tom, before you do anything crazy, answer me one question. Why is it I have a house and you have an apartment? Yeah, maybe you should jump. Well, oh, hold on. This this is still Superman. They can uh, X-ray, use X-ray vision, kind of. But I didn't think that it'll affect the people though. Lois, know you here? No clue. I brought beer. I brought pot. Oh, and now I feel stupid. I bought crack. I brought pot. I brought acid. Oh, and now I feel stupid. I brought crystal meth. I brought ten rounds of chemotherapy. I think we may have gone too far. Now I feel bad for laughing at my dad when he went through this. Oh my god, look you guys, it's death! Hey, has anyone got a cell phone I can borrow? God's been paging me for like 20 minutes. Wait, you still use a pager? Yeah, well, we thought once we got Steve Jobs in heaven we'd all get iPhones, but he never showed up. Wait a minute. You work with God? Oh, death, we've been looking all Damn, over the he never Will showed up. Him? Sure, but don't you mean her? Look at your faces. Of course it's a dude. Come on, let's go. Well, I'm glad everything's back to normal. Peter, your mother's dead. Yeah, but at least she's alive. What are you talking about, Peter? Well, you see, Lois, the key in life is to lie to yourself about reality. Smile through everything. All the bad things, well, you just pile them away in a place that will come back one day in the form of, I don't know, rage? But everything's fine. I'll see you in bed. Okay. Dang it. God dang it. Do you have any idea how fast you were going, sir? Peter? Hey, Cleveland. Peter Griffin. This is just so we can talk without getting spotted by Lois or Donna. I need you to step out of the car, sir. Peter, there's got to be a better way. He's got a knife! Ow, ow, ow. Sorry, Cleveland. It's got to be authentic. Stay down! Ow. Stay down! Ow. Cleveland, try to grab my gun. Oh, trying to grab my gun, are you? Ow. Ow. <laughs> hey, rookie, save some for me. Wow, the whole gang's back together. Just shut up. We don't need you in this town. Ow, ow. Oh, great. I'm gonna get killed by a cat. They'll never let me live this down in doggy heaven. That's crazy. <laughs> hey, there's that guy who got killed by a cat. <laughs> <laughs> what about some dead that guy that got killed by a cat, bro? Oh, my mom, my look. That would get that head fat on. Oh, my mom. mom. <laughs> shut up. How'd you guys die? We bit kids. Woo! Biting kids! Yeah, unpettable! I miss biting kids. Ugh, the elevator's taking forever. I I'm just gonna use the stairs. There were two homeless people eating each other in there. Oh, come on. It's not that bad. Your life could be worse. You could be a black. A black. Go ahead. A blanket. <laughs> well, the only mouse in this neighborhood is our innocent neighbor, Frank Maxwell. Comrade Mouskowitz, did you think I, I seen those forever? Forever. Hi, uh, I think you've got the wrong mouse. I'm just regular old Frank Maxwell, and I'm very late for work. Good day, ma'am. Oh, you killed him? That was not me. Someone else got to him first. Tough break, Jew mouse. Huh? We now return to Meredith Baxter in Rape. But that is Tom. crazy, though. It was awful. He made me do things. Awful things. What kinds of things? I don't even want to talk about it. <laughs> they ain't got the thing in their conversation. Huggle, like, come on now. Oh my god! Peter, you killed it! Well, you guys relax. He's got eight more lives. Okay, seven more lives. Six more Six. lives. Five. Five. Four. Four. Three. Three. Peter, Two. stop doing what you're doing. Wait, it'll seem like the cat ran away. We'll never get away with that. 
Oh, we just might. You see, I've got a lucky cat's foot. Okay, but I gotta be home by seven. I'm supposed to talk to the police about what? that shooting I witnessed. Good lord, you all right? If I die, leave two dollars worth of flowers right here. Here's my fourth grade class photo. Lean it against the cheap candle. Well, should I call an ambulance? No, call channel nine and have a gap-toothed woman say, quote, he never bothered nobody. I love how all the servers look like celebrities from the 50s. Marilyn Monroe? Elvis? Yeah, look, he always right there, Christine okay. Dean after the accident. Let me tell you about tonight's specials. Oh, look. I'm just saying, though, why would, if, if it was like a restaurant, why would they have somebody in there with a tie in their head? Like, bruh. Like, bruh. What? Just it were bleeding. Finally made it. Oh, hey there, Griffins. Oh, hold on, what's oh, Cleveland finally made it. Oh, hey there, Griffins. Oh, that take. Yeah, they going a little too dark with it, but like, I mean, this this, this is the literally the only show they can get away with some shit like that. So I mean. I don't know. It, 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 I don't really know how I feel about that. Cause like, bro, certain parts where it was just like, I just want to laugh through the shit, even though it's not really funny to be laughing and shit like that, though. But I mean, it's just like, bro. I mean, it's just America we live in. It's just how it used to be back then. It's really like, yeah, ain't nothing we can do. But, but I don't know. I don't know. Bro. 